Hey, hey. Hey, everyone. Check it out. Here's my impression of V-Dub. Uh. Uh. It's my best impression. So this is, um, this is a game that I haven't played on stream yet. Y yeah. And it's, it's, uh, the Call of Duty game. I'm gonna play a little bit of this for a bit. Um, and now that I've become a little more familiar with it, I haven't really played it too much, but, eh, it's okay. I'll do this for a bit, and then I'll get a couple of lads in for some Warzone. And then, Bug Snacks. And the reason I'm doing Bug Snacks again tonight is because, A... People like it. B, I like it. C, I want to keep it fresh in my mind because I won't be able to stream it again for a couple days. And um, I figure, why not? It's definitely a game that people have um, requested a lot of. So, I have no problem with it. Vinny, do you plan on streaming the campaign for Cold War? No, not really. Cod Bro Gaming Gaming. What's your name? Uh, play the damn zombies mode, coward. <laughs> um, V-Dub did. So, uh... <laughs> I don't think I'm saying your name right, I just like it. Uh, no, I, I'm not gonna do zombie mode today. Maybe in the future. Just do some matches. Some low effort fight. And then the, um... The war zone. I've heard that the campaign is good. And I'm maybe going to do that one day. So, someone else said, are you taking tomorrow off? Uh, no, I'll be streaming. Tomorrow, as you know, is my Zelda 2 randomized day. And I'm also going to do um, a little Animal Crossing, I think. So. So, yeah. This game list is Whiplash. I know. This is like Animal Crossing and Doom all over again. Vinny, I've got a $550 CPU. This game still runs like crap. <laughs> yeah. Vinny, are you going to fry a twerky? No, probably not. Might get a turkey. Or, you know, but I'm not going to fry one up myself. I don't have that ability. All I want is Brussels sprouts. Again, you may think Brussels sprouts are gross, but then you're cooking them wrong. You don't boil them. You have to just put them in the oven with oil, salt, pepper, a little garlic. Let them crisp up a bit. Crisp them up, chat. Team Deathmatch. Team Deathmatch. CIA team, defend our freedom. Just gonna lower the volume a little bit. It's more the texture that puts you off? That's fair. I mean, there's a lot of food that I don't like because the texture's weird. So I, I totally get that. I can't think of any at the moment! We're in the lead. Female enemy removed. Okay. <laughs> if you say so, man. Oh, fuck you! See, here we go. Here we go, now I'm cursing. Yeah, why was there a fucking specification? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> that was- I've never heard that in this game. I usually- I've played this game in the past while listening to a podcast. And it's been a good way to pass, like, a good hour before I get sick of it, you know? Oh, fuck. Alright, chat. I'll, I'll be honest, I am not sure the SMGs in this game are for me, or are good. I've heard there are issues of, of, like, balancing in this game, where people are like, some guns just flat out suck. I don't know if that's true. I just don't know if I like the SMGs, personally. I've been having, I've been struggling with them. And again, I'm only level 13, I barely played this game. You know, the only reason I have such a high level in Warzone, or in uh, Modern Warfare, is because of Warzone. You get, uh, levels in there. 
And also, why am I playing this tonight? I was just trying to figure out what game do I want to play tonight? Like, what, what kind of video game experience do I want to have? Well, obviously bugs. Oh, there you go. And also getting shot in the back of the head. Of course. That's obvious. But yeah, I just felt like playing a shooter. I like a good shooter every now and then. And, uh, so that's why I'm doing this. Whoa! Damn! And this is why SMGs on certain maps don't work. This is not a good map for SMGs. It's too long distance, too r long range. Yeah! Yeah! Alright, well at least I got level 3 on the MP5. That's all I needed. Yep! Okay, good enough. I am good at this game, thank you. I know, I know. V-Dub claims to have the, the, the market cornered on Call of Duty Pros, but I watched his gameplay. Enemy counter spy plane inbound. It's up, all top inbound. Ha <laughs> ha I got that kill. <laughs> Fuck yeah, you see what I mean? V-Dub thinking he's the shit. Can he can he throw a grenade? Can he press the grenade button? I wonder. Stun! Shit. If only I didn't try to throw that mine, I would have lived. This isn't working. We're behind. How behind are we? I can't tell. Oh, we're we're right neck and neck. We're the, ah! That was. That was fun. Vinny, the M16 is broken. Vinny, the game has ray tracing. Is it on? I, I can't tell. Let me sit back. I need to- I need to sit back and relax a little bit. Here, I'm gonna use... What class am I gonna do? I wanna do this one. This one I have the most experience with. And I'm gonna, like, get in my gamer position. This is the, um... The almost fully recli reclined <laughs> at a 90 degree angle position. And you know why I do this? To get a full range of vision on my monitor. Not because I'm a lazy fuck, but because I need a full range of vision. I can see everything. Like Patrick Stewart, I can see everything now. Shoot. Real gamers have good posture. Yeah, well, maybe when I play VR. Yeah! N.A. Aim. I do have another VR game that I, I thought what might be interesting for the stream. And, uh, it's like another fight with swords game, but it's a roguelite-ish thing. And it looks cool, and I don't remember the name of it, but... Until you fall, maybe? Yep, that's the one. And, uh, I was gonna do that, but I definitely am not feeling it today. Today was a busy, long day for me. I decided against... Oh. Shoot the plane with the gun. Restricted area. What? Could there be clearer boundaries? I mean, fence is, is all well and good, but it's like chest high fence. That's not really enough for me. Like, I need a big, like, big arrow or a big red X. Throwing grenade! Oh. 
Oh, where did he go? How did he do that? That's good. Let's use the spy plane. Hunter requesting spy plane. Spy plane commencing surveillance operation. Enemy spy plane inbound. I feel like this game also, yeah, this game struggles with performance too. It's got performance anxiety, chat! I'm good. Bushwhack. We're in the lead. Well, I got the frag kill. You see that? I I know what I'm doing. I'm I'm gamers. No, 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 not doing it. No. Someone said, what the hell is Vinny doing playing Call of Duty unironically? So this is, um, this is a video game. Um, I've, I've streamed it a lot. Uh, Warzone, the previous game, Modern Warfare Warzone, which I'll be doing Warzone with the lads later. Um, it turns out that these are pretty solid shooters. And it'd be easy to make fun of them, but that's so 2011. V-Dub is in New Jersey, I think, right now. He told me he was waiting online for, uh, medicine, but that they don't sell it yet. I don't know what he was talking about. Enemy sentry turret detected in your AO. Fucker. We can almost win this match if we just play less like shit, myself especially. This isn't how we drilled it. Pull it back. Look at these comrades. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Against us. Bring this home. He's done. He's done. We're only like... Fuck. All because I had to press the button and throw the goddamn... The mine. Okay. What? All operators proceed to Xville Point. Get it together, people. We need to go again. Vinny, did you buy the weed skins yet? I don't think they exist yet. Staff Sergeant 2, hell yeah. Let's see, V-Dub can eat a dick. I unlocked uh, some stuff as well, so why not? That's good, we can we can do the things. Uh, we don't need to look at my um, kill-to-death ratio. I think, you know, it's it's better you don't know, is, is my opinion. So what are we replacing? We'll replace the red dot. We don't need the red dot for this thing. Okay. Uh. So, my, my real opinion on this game is that it has some cool stuff in it, and I like how, you know, like, stylized it's trying to be. But War, uh, Modern Warfare was the first Call of Duty game I actually liked in 10 years. Aside from the World War II one that recently came out, which I liked because it was World War II themed. As, as a game, it was pretty okay. It was more of the same. Vinny, would you try Zombies mode? Well, V-Dub did. Um, would I? Is, is a good question. The answer is, I would. I think in the future I would.
dog call cod is hella based, my guy, says chat member. Excuse me, what is this? The wep the bonus weapon experience is crazy in zombies right now? Okay, we'll be playing zombies tonight. Two times experience. Kill confirmed. Okay, I've never done this map before, I don't think. Did V-Dub do it? I don't remember, it doesn't matter. This- I- I don't remember it. Oh yeah, I think he did. Don't, they accidentally busted the weapon XP but patched it, fucked up the patch, so now you're getting less than one- You're getting less than one times XP? What the fuck? I know this game was rushed, I know they had to like... ...do things to make it less rushed. But damn. In this game mode, you have to collect dog tags. For those that have never played the Call of Duty series. You know, all 85 games that are out available in this series. Ooh, okay. Alright, I got a couple kills there. Couple kills. Again, meaningless unless you pick up the dog tags, but... Shoot someone with my revolver. This gun was a pretty good gun! Alright, I'm good. Vinny, this isn't Warzone yet. Where's that's what? No, this is not War Warzone. Is later. I this also I put in the the title Kill Fight. This is not Call of Duty Kill Fight yet. That's 2022's Call of Duty. How did I blew a golden opportunity there. That was a really good opportunity to get a kill. Setting waypoint. <laughs> Enemy gamer confirmed. All right, we got this. Turn off your light? Dog, I don't know how to. You can't? What was that? Did he use? Oh, that was a sniper rifle? Oh, that was a shotgun. Alright. Fair enough. Um, I'm gonna switch back to this. No, wait, wait. The AK-47, I haven't really used too much. I like the... this tactical rifle thing, as you can see. But yeah, I just got, like, close range... with a sniper rifle, so that's... always a good time. That's when you feel best about yourself when you play Call of Duty, when that happens. Oh, it was a shotgun. Wait a minute, my brain is scrambled. Military age male neutralized.
Did I take off the scope on this? Or the sight? I think I did by accident. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. These horrendous noises. Let me, uh, configure this. Rapid fire. Front grip. And 30 round magazine. There we go. I love explosive spam. Shit. There we go. Here's a nice monstrosity of a gun. Enemy spy plane in I think I picked up an AUG by accident. You bet I did. Play of the game right there. You just saw it, chat. You just saw it. Multiple enemy spy plane Going frag grenade. Then we turn it established. And then I die in the lamest way possible. Available. That sounded like a voice I do. Where? Incoming. Oh shit! <laughs> that was Han Solo turning the corner into a room full of stormtroopers. Okay. There's some there's some heavy hefty bullshit. Try the M16 a little bit after this. Vinny, use that spy plane you have. Oh, yeah. Let me see what I have here. Got a random kill streak. I think it's random. Vinny, are you going to do your Thanksgiving Mario World stream tomorrow? Where did the idea of Mario World come from? I haven't said I was doing Mario World. Threat clear. It's it's Zelda 2. Mario World, I, I have traditionally done Thanksgiving. It's my Thanksgiving game from when I was a kid, but I don't... I haven't said I was going to stream Mario World anytime soon. I might, maybe Christmas-ish, like a world randomized thing. Deploying sentry turret. Mistakes were made, it said. Best play. Vine sauce. There's the AUG. I told you it was gonna happen this way. This is the first time I got in the best play in this game. Team sucks, bro. Oh man, I carried this whole fucking team, dude. Oh. <laughs> Speed tape weapon attachment. Eighteen kills, though. All right. Do a couple more. 
of this before I do Warzone. Fuck is speed tape. Speed tape. Plus 10% aim down sight time. Uh, okay, putting tape on your weapon means that you can look down the sights faster. Vinny, did you see the PS5 scalper on Twitter who got doxxed and robbed? Yeah, I mean, uh, obviously the doxing is... ethically questionable at best. Um, I know people are omega lulling and, car and saying karma and all that. He had, like, how many? PS5s, and he was charging $1,100 for them. He had like 50 PS5s or so. Or 19. Yeah, he, he really... You know, I, I say that, sadly, he kind of did get what he deserved, but it's just, I wish there was a better way to handle stuff like that. I wish there was a way to stop it. Without it resorting to fucking vigilante justice. But, yeah, what a greedy cunt. What a greedy cunt. And then he bragged about it on Twitter and was like, yeah, fuck you, I don't care. $1,100 for a PS5. So. Wait, this is hard point? Oh, fuck. Syntax point. <laughs> yeah, I gotta use a better weapon than this. Um, let's do... let's do this. For, the, for this game mode, a machine gun is usually a pretty good idea. There's the play of the game. You just saw it. This thing just needs a sight. Maybe there's a... Optic. An optic for this thing. Instantly way better. <laughs> ah yes, spamming shots. My specialty. Whoa. I actually like this map. This is probably one of the few maps. Oh! This is one of the few maps that um, I like in this game. I think Modern Warfare had way better maps. Damn. How do you feel about the gunplay? I I'm not, like, an expert enough to tell you the differences. I just feel like the gunplay in Modern Warfare was probably a little bit better. I just don't know. I mean, this feels like more classic Call of Duty. Do Nuketown, it's madness. You know, I've, I have not the same nostalgia for Nuketown as many people do because I was not playing that game, that Nuketown. Um, I didn't play the game that Nuketown was introduced. I stopped at Modern Warfare 2. Hostiles have the hard point. That was where I gave up. I, like... I unironically liked Call of Duty from Modern Warfare, World of War, Modern Warfare 2. Then I stopped, and then began the long decline of my interest in the series. And me making fun of it. 
because of the yearly releases and the um, epic gamertude and the Mountain Dew. That's kill. And then somewhere along the line, maybe when like Battle Royales got really popular, I'm not sure, I kind of came back around to Call of Duty because they keep giving me keys to this shit every year. And I'm like, alright, well, may as well play it. After V-Dub does, give it a shot. And then, Modern Warfare was, like, really good. And the World War II one felt more like they returned to their roots, but it was still not amazing. The campaign was every cliche you could imagine for a first-person shooter. Like, every single cliche. But it was still pretty good. How's the gunplay compared to Titanfall 2? I haven't played Titanfall 2 in so long. Also, there's a music player. Multiple enemy spy plane contacts. You can just play music. Like just random music. Okay. point is secured. Titanfall 2 is much better, says a chat member. I love Titanfall 2. Titanfall 2 was my favorite first-person shooter in a while when I played that. I just lost sight. The muzzle flash was, like, so overpowering, I lost sight of my, my opponent, my any enemy gamer. Double. I just, man, if I could have just gotten just a couple more seconds, I would have been able to get the whole team. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit. Let's go back to this. This gun is very precise. Vinny blind? Oh yeah, no, there's always... There's always me missing... things. Always. Throwing grenade! Vinny, play Apex. Why is it that when you play one game, so many gamers ask for a different game? So, um, I played Apex. I did. It was- it was okay. I know Respawn made it. I liked it. I had fun with it for like, maybe a, a couple weeks. But, I never streamed it. Then he plays Zelda too. That, my friend, I can Zelda do. Hell no! Nope! Watch this, chat. Napalm, here we go. Alright, not a single kill. Sick. Yeah! Yeah, die from my own fire! Nope. We are so fucked. This this team, we are just we're destroyed. Ceiling This is why it when you when you play hard point, it's just grenade spam, and I contribute to the grenades. Grenade spam. I do.
Oh man. Going back to the machine gun. Stoner, this is called. I'm surprised VW didn't use much of this weapon on his stream. Uh, that that happens. That's the call of duty for you, chat. That's what happens. Yep. That too. Report to your nearest Casavac site. Oh. Mission is Fubar. I didn't get the best play. played some Hyrule Warriors today, and there's a mission where you have to... It's uh, a side quest mission. Where you have to... Fight... A... Hinox. A Talos. And a Lionel. In a row. Like, one after the other. And some supporting enemies. And I used the Master Sword. And it fucking sucked. It, I was playing it for an hour and, and lost every time. What can you do? That's what happens when you do it. That's what that's the Hyrule Warriors way, I guess. Um the Krig 6, full auto assault rifle, improved damage and accuracy. So this is um Man, again, this is why I like sci-fi games with like sci-fi guns because it's like a lot of these guns just are the same but bullet come out a little slow then you use different gun bullet come out slightly fast got a melee weapon here that's fine I can just use what do you mean there's no attachments for the knife i can't put a scope on it Too much paranoia. Domination. Securing Alpha. Take the objectives. A secure. Enemy has Charlie. Oh, this map is okay too. I, I have had fun with this map on occasion. Played it like two times. Yep. Losing B. Enemy has B. Securing Charlie. <laughs> what am I gonna do with my knife? I need to be faster if I'm going to use the knife. I remember in, in um, Modern Warfare 2, that was how so many people got kill streaks. You just like lock on with the knife using the controller's auto aim and just fucking knife people like crazy. And it would work. But yeah, the knife scope would make it so much more accurate. Loud noises, chat. Whoa! Okay, I can edit. 
I want to get this thing. Securing C. I get an optic. Losing A. Seems like a fine weapon. Losing B. We've taken the lead. Yes! I got a knife kill! That's all I wanted! I'm so happy. Ow. My fucking eyes. What, I'm sorry, what did that man just say? Hostile ODXD in your AO? What did you say about my AO? Ma'am neutralized. Did, did, did my character just say ma'am neutralized? What the fuck is this game? I don't think that's what he said. I don't believe it. And if, if he did, I would have to be very confused. And so I am confused. Um. Well, at least when I play bug snacks, you know I'm not gonna scream like this. Target eliminated. Hunter requesting spy plane. Spy plane in the turn. Mission timeline is losing Bravo. Just waiting for a dude. To knife! Ugh. Tried to knife camp. Wasted her. Security Ah yes, grenade spam point, or as more commonly known, fuck fuck point. Going for the. Losing Bravo. I'll try a sniper. We This dude in my way is not why I died, but it probably didn't help. Little RC cars just chilling. Half time. Let's see. Let's see what the most gamerous thing that you could do in this game is. It's that. All right, that's actually really good. That was really good. Good for them. What's the deal with tactical games having bows, crossbows as weapons? It's funny because I complain about the bows and crossbows, but then I also complain about lack of weapon variety. Taking Charlie. Enemy has Alpha. Do you remember that year where bows were just in every game? It was just a thing that was, like, popular. <laughs> I was busy switching my weapon. Person was just there, and my teammate was just ignoring it. Enemy took B. Enemy 
Enemy oh no! Grenade! No oh, grenade! No more. That sounded like the engineer. No more! They just spawned in, to be fair. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess that was the spawn point. Point. The absolute gall of my gun to shoot everywhere but that person's head. Wow, what was that aim? <sighs> Holy shit. We lost feet. Chat, that was garbage. No! <laughs> Hostile spy plane established overhead. We're losing this fight. He's the one, and he likes to shoot his gun. Multiple enemy spy plane he contacts. likes to sing along. And he likes to shoot his gun, but he knows not what it means. I'm on the zone. Never mind. I saw what was going on. That was terrible. But I saw what that dude was trying to do. He was trying to use the knife. That was me like 10 minutes ago. Oof. Yep. Can't see a goddamn thing. That's that's the Call of Duty way. Let me, let me do a little bit of stoning. Oh man, we are going to lose this. Well, when, when you do plays like that, it's not really a wonder why, but yeah, we're, we, uh, we're definitely fucked. This is, maybe not this weapon, maybe this isn't the good. Maybe I need to go back to my knife. And we are done. Threat clear. <laughs> At least he killed himself too. Damn. I was just hoping someone would walk into my hail of bullets. We're overrun. Survivors withdraw to evac point. Got bollocks. Bopsicle.
All right, cool. We're going to play uh, Warzone now. It's okay. It's more of the same. If you like that gameplay loop, it's there. But I'm sure the people who know all the Call of Duties can pick out all the specific details of everything that's different, better, worse. Do you have to quit to play Warzone? It just opens the, the Modern Warfare one. <laughs> so, yeah. There, what? How? Hello? Hello? Connecting? Whoa, that took a long time to connect. Hi. What's up? Not much. We have, um, these are chat. This is just me. I'm just, you know, doing different voices. And, uh, I will be playing Call of Duty Warzone with myself twice. A good call because I have to download 30 gigs. Are you serious? Whoa, really? Apparently, I thought I could, I just had it, but nope. So you two uh -oh. have. All right. Well, Jeff oh, is well, here. We, we can do a trio. Yeah, we could do that. Okay. Um... It's nice to go back to Warzone chat because my weed is all unlocked here. Vinny, have you ever played Gunfight? Yeah, it's good. Give me one second. There's the screen. And, uh, Jeff, are you here? Yeah, I'm just eating a hamburger real quick. I'll be here almost done. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why that was funny. Um, I had, yeah, I had a terrible hamburger yesterday. I'm sure you all heard. Yeah, it's a shame. Yeah. Vinny, your bungalow. Oh, you were able has to join me. Oh, okay. Nice mic. That was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Are you I George? I, have... I, I guess I am George. Yes, that is my name. Hello. Okay, desert is George. I like I how these Jeff are in here now. These are like uh, code names, like streamer mode code names, and it just gave you like a like a like a regular name. Who the fuck is Weschler? You don't know Weschler? <laughs> James. You don't Weschler. know my dude Weschler? Um, that is you, right, Jeff? Maybe. Who's Jeff? I don't know. Who's Jeff? Who's everyone? Who's anyone? Oh, wait. Chat, I got a free bundle that I can unlock. It's Desert. You want this bundle. Trust me. Desert Scorpion? Yep. That's a good bundle. That, that looks... Dude, scorpions are sick. Wow, that's that really that loud. Bundle, I, I ate a scorpion. Ones today. There's a scorpion and a bottle of tequila, and I ate it one time. You yeah, they do that. Lollipops. Yeah, that's a thing that you can purchase and eat. Yeah. The crunch is so delicious when you eat when you get down to the Scorpion Center. I, I don't think they put those in that snack crate shit I was getting. So that's a shame. You know, the venom makes your tongue tingle a little bit. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty. Vinny by anime. Um. No. Actually, wait, I should make you party leader. Uh, can I even do that? I don't know if there's a way to do that. There's All the right, anime well, guns. What did you want to what did you want to play? Did you want to do, do like a trio. Just regular yeah. trio? Okay. There really is a lot of anime. Oh, so there's an actual anime pack. Dandere. Dandere? Bunny gun. 
<laughs> oh, that's Bunny Yasondo. That's her. <laughs> Finally, we found her. Oh my god, what is she doing in this game? <laughs> Look at this thing. Oh my god. But that's how you know, like, if you if you end up getting, like, if you kill someone with that ga gun, you are the truest gamer. Good luck hiding with that gun. It's camouflage in uh, Candyland, at least. Yeah. Who's this other random guy in our team? Did you see that? See, what? It's the Did random not, people yeah. that, like, pop in and out. There was a person, it's an I masturbate. That's the guy's name. <laughs> <laughs> Does Jeff oh, have an out of context channel? Yeah, <laughs> that's my boy, I masturbate. He's he's great. He was gonna join <laughs> us, but I guess he got nervous and he left. <laughs> Performance anxiety. <laughs> I mean he's really good at shooting. Also Sometimes be sure to shoots blanks though. <laughs> God damn it. Um be sure to check your settings if it's blurry. Because my Blurry? my game yeah my game reset and my resolution scale was all the way down. Oh, oh no! I've been I've been testing my 3080. Mine mine's fine. Okay, cool. Yeah, I guess sometimes they update it though. Your settings like get reset if they did like a major upgrade. Yep. Oh, what the fuck? I'm I'm running at like double speed right now. I'm gonna lower my. Yeah, that your 3080 is overclocking the game. You're gonna be like hit with a, like a ban for cheating. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Jeff, what kind of burger do you have? Like, from where? Did you make it? Did you buy it? It was a baconator. It's gone now. I don't like those as much as I like the the classics, honestly. They're good. Sometimes you just don't want grass on your burger, you know what I mean? I hear you, dude. I hear you. Especially last night, the burger I got was like 80% lettuce. So. Man, if you want grass, just go outside and grab some. It's free. It's lettuce there. is like so out. Nobody wants lettuce anymore. Dude, that's not true. You can go to Shake Shack and get a burger with a, like lettuce instead of a bun. <laughs> and like your hands are all wet and fucking slimy from the lettuce. It's fun. Honestly, I like those, um, because I have to, like, cut carbs out of my diet. Yeah, it's it's a carb cutter. Yeah. Romaine. Like, sometimes they make them, like, a salad, too, but, like, yeah, the lettuce wraps are actually pretty damn nice. You have to get some romaine that actually has, like, nutritional value to it. Yeah. Iceberg is the just, like, water. The key is like to water. not get it loaded up <gasps> with condiments. Almost forgot to pull my parachute. Oh, my God. Because if you load that shit up with sauce, it's all gonna, like, get all over your hands. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. It's part of the fun, though. <laughs> That's why I yeah, wear my I mean, burger gloves. Have a little fun while you eat. Oh fuck! What did I just do? What about a glove you use to what about eat your burger? A glove <laughs> so that the ice cream doesn't melt. <laughs> it's a hoverboard. I like when he he proposes the hoverboard idea, and then he starts like laughing a little bit, and he has to stop himself <laughs> from laughing. <laughs> Yeah, he breaks character. It's pretty awesome. Honestly, I can't believe he's able to do what he does without breaking character. And same for Nathan Fielder. Oh, yeah, Nathan. Who, Ali D? Yeah. The, the times that Nathan has broke character, though, are, like, the best. Like, when that, kid, that old guy is talking about drinking his grandson's piss. <laughs> Nathan, you are like, scared to drink the child's <laughs> pee. It's like, Nathan, what? <laughs> He Nathan's almost like, fucking wait, breaks what? character! Why do you drink he the pee? He's like, what did you say? He actually does break character. Okay, chat, you need context, so if you want to know what the fuck we're talking about... No older than five. No older it's than true. five. It's, it's, it tastes bad after, it, after it's five. It's really... It has no health it's effects. It's fucked! It was so fucked up! So... <laughs> he just starts... I think that dude, like, started to realize that he was, like, kind of laughing at him. And he starts, like, playing it up a little bit, but I don't know, man. Yeah, that was I don't. A weird I, bit. I think that's just like one of those ancient <laughs> remedies from his village. 
Chat. It's like <laughs> no, yeah, there are people that believe that. Like he, he was like urine is like a medicine or something. I think he misspoke and he was like invested in it at that point. And he was like, "Fuck it, like I'm going all the way." Like, <laughs> yeah, we like come this, this far. I'm sorry, I disagree. I think it was real, and I think he does in fact do that exact thing. No, I bet it is real. <laughs> so, chat. Okay, on YouTube, type Nathan for you. P. Oh, I wish watch we could show clip. this clip. It would just get was, claimed to oblivion. It was trending on Twitter the other day. That's what I thought. Oh, about. was it? Oh, why? Yeah, why? Is there any know. reason? People, there's something about breaking character. I don't know. I, I forget uh, what that was. It could have been something I saw on Twitter, maybe instead. That's still one of like the best moments of that show. Oh yeah, definitely. It's like, I like the, the one with J Squad where he also starts like to break character when they <laughs> when they talk about like <laughs> double donging. Two brothers are like fucking the same chick at the same time. <laughs> And, and like they're telling Nathan this this thing that they do and Nathan starts laughing while he's in a Peter Pan costume and it's just perfect. Tell him about J-Squad, bro. J-Squad! We hit it Tell up with J-Squad! Squad. So this has become insane already. Just having you guys on, we're already talking about Nathan for you. It didn't take long. <laughs> I've but, been yeah. watching it lately too, so. But he breaks character so infrequently that it's like his entire break character compilation is like two minutes. Yeah. Which is crazy, like how good he is at keeping that. Jimmy Fallon's break character Success compilation is his anybody. whole career. And then they were like, let's give him the late night show. And that's how it happened. This place is dry, we need to head somewhere else and get more loot. Alright, J-Squad, bed out. J-Squad! Whoa! Oh fuck, dude. J-Squad, help! Where, 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 where? What the fuck?! Moving position, never mind. They're right on the the road there, on the road up top. Yeah, we're. That just I just marked them. I can't. I'm in the bush. I think they don't see me. Oh. Nope, they see me. I'm dead. Me too. <laughs> I got him with a 50 <laughs> cal sniper rifle. Nowhere. 50 cal sniper rifle, and I'm dead. Hmm. It's fun. Weed camo don't help when you're on a mountain. I mean, with the mountain head, I can think of it. ways to use it. Here we go. Was I killed by an anime gun? You're up next, mate. Get ready. An anime gun or an enemy gun? Both. An enemy, enemy? An enemy gun. Oh, I died. That's all right. I'm gonna an win. I'm gonna win my my gulag. I want my gulag. You lose your fight. Sort them out or capture the objective. Where you at, Dave? We're halfway done. Ten minutes left. We will. Yeah, you'll be in a match at least. I'm well. so mad they took out the night maps. It just why? Yeah, they looked good. Yeah, they were great. Uh oh. Jesus. Launching Warzone from Cold War. Launches modern warfare. It just launches modern warfare, exactly. Yeah. Which means, like, you can't keep Cold War up to date, technically, unless you're keeping modern warfare up to date. It's a mess. It, it is a bit of a mess. Wait, really? And also, I heard, uh, it, oh, wait, it's kind no. of funny. No, Dave. No. No, if you what? just keep warfare, um, wars, modern warfare up to date, you can play Warzone. But then you have to update yeah, that's... Cold War independently, so you need to keep both updated. Yeah. Oh. I'm saying if you don't own Modern Warfare, which I don't, then you don't think that you have to keep both of them updated if you own but, but one you of do. them. You do. Right. This is like a fucking Abbott and Costello bit now. <laughs> the other funny thing is if you don't own Modern Warfare and you bought Cold War, you'd jump into War Zone and not know what leaning is, because that's not in Cold War. Wait, there's leaning in this? Yeah, it's... Like... Well, poke, peeking uh, around corners and stuff, yeah. What button? Yeah, ma mounting onto corners. Oh, the mounting. Yeah, yeah. That's not in Cold War, so that's like an actual gameplay difference between the two. True.
There's no there's, sliding there's in Cold War either. Like there's sliding in Cold War. Wait, there is? You gotta rebind it, but yeah, there's sliding. Oh, been, really? I didn't know they that. Didn't it. Just yeah, that's a modern They didn't, they didn't a modern. know how to slide back then. <laughs> Could you imagine, more like, honor. in real life, like, our current army is taught the sliding techniques? <laughs> and, like, they just send, like, squads of dudes, like, sliding their way through doors and shit? This is how you grenade spam, soldier. J-Squad! <laughs> J-Squad! Yeah, help it now. Drop on the way. We have to get money to get Jeff back, so I'm, I'm just gonna... ...run into these, um... Lovely apartment <laughs> complexes here. Got gas inbound. Safe zone relocated. This building has been unlooted. Does that mean it's been looted or it has not been looted? It has not been looted. Oh, okay. I hear a bounty thing. Oh, the phone's ringing. Moshi Moshi. I don't understand the point of the phone thing. There's a phone thing in this game? What yeah, the phones in like buildings will occasionally ring. If you press E on them, it'll actually like turn into a call with like some dude yelling at you in Russian. Maybe that's... Maybe Mono I think it was knows. like an ARG th or maybe, I don't know, yeah. All right. That's just how Grubhub works in Russia. <laughs> <laughs> that's why. That's why everything's all fucked up. In Soviet Russia, Grubhub orders you. Oh, there's a buy station here, Desert. We can get Jeff back right here. Jeff, can you press? Never mind. No, you. Boy, yeah, wait. Station. We definitely have enough. Um, yeah. Here, let me give you my money. Get in there and. Uh... Hold on a second. Gonna load some money. Yeah, that's, that's definitely enough. Mono says phones open the nuke bunker. Oh right. That's cool. We're inside the phone. Keep your eyes open. All right. Coming down. Yeah, there's some weapons in this building too, Jeff. So you be able to grab a couple. Bunger. Bunger bunger. Nuclear bunger. Ah, you son of a pie. <laughs> that was like delayed. I don't have good reaction time. <laughs> All right. I'm not seeing anyone. Oh, wait, shit, no, there's two ATVs coming two ATVs. up here. Two ATVs. Oh, they're coming right over here. Okay, they're in the- they're in that police station or fire station, whatever the fuck it is. Restaurant. Do we... Maybe, like, wait for them? Ah. Uh, yeah. To, hard to tell. They're on the second floor. I just downed him. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. We gotta just seal gonna the, get back up though. Seal the deal, I guess. Nah, they got back up. Well, they know we're here now. I mean, yeah, we could run or we could just like wait for them to pop out again. I'm down for whatever. <laughs> Got him! Nice. That, there's another one though. Whoa! Oh! I'm down. Jesus. By the way, I need I need to fall back a little bit. Watch the door. Oh, they tried to Molotov us. Oh, here he comes! Yeah. Not today. There's still others in there, I think. Didn't say squad wipe. Damn, Desert, you're fucking murdering them tonight. 
I'm gonna try to pull I have the bloodlust. Do you see him? It won't be satiated until I kill everyone. I wonder if that door was open up there before. The train's going by too. Uh, yeah, it was. That's where I killed one of them. Hostile dropping into the area. Watch the skies. Uh, oh, so yeah, they just, one incoming. of them just dropped in. Oh, yeah, I see them. They're on the roof. Jesus, I'm not seeing anything. Just watch the roof. Dude, there's a quad stuck on the wall over here. What the fuck? I'm putting armor on. Give me a second. Oh, they're behind me. Yep, they're on the side of the building. Yeah, I saw. Yeah, you got me. Careful. Careful, careful, careful. I got you. Gonna reset my armor. Same. I could probably don't have very much time. Oh, whoa! Hill! Behind. Uh, behind us? Yeah, they're flanking. Ooh. Shit. That got wild. What a fucking bullet sponge that dude was. Where you at, Dave? How many armor plates do you have in that vest? That vest was like... 75 kilos. Vinny, that gun's range was poop. I should've used the fucking sniper rifle that I had. Yes, Dave, are you... download? David. Uh. Que pasa? Also, it's throwing it on my other monitor for some reason, so I think I lost a bunch of settings. Oh. Hey guys, guys now, right? welcome to the game. Did, was that? Invite. Did was there a fifth player here from EB Games? <laughs> yeah, that's my boy, uh, John EB Games. Oh, cool. They're a bit just... quiet, but every now and then they speak up. It, it's the the avatar that uh, Dave uses in VR chat. <laughs> oh man, that's a good idea. Dave, you ready? I give me just one second. Okay. Dave is Ferguson. Yeah, I'm ready. All right. He's the brother from Clarissa. Explains it all. <laughs> I was the first thing I no. thought. No. <laughs> what? Why? What? Who's the? What? You know the emote when something's actually not funny and people post the emote. What's that Long one? Jam? That one? No, no. It's the one that they're posting in chat. Oh, oh, the ha-ha one. <laughs> yeah, that ha-ha, that's Ferguson from Clarissa Explains It All, but Ferguson's just got red hair. That's the only difference. Same same thing, same thing. Alright. That's it. It's Did Andy he... Samberg. That's Andy Samberg? You didn't yeah. know that? Oh, yeah, well, now that I click it, yeah. What is it from? Is it from a movie he was in, or...? Some SNL gift get for some fucking music video he made, I think. Oh, okay. Lonely Island thing. That I was... forget exactly what it was. Shy Ronnie from SNL. Oh, okay. Check your gear and weapons. Planes are making ready for deployment. The vast majority of this chat doesn't know Clarissa explains it all. Okay. Chat, do you know Sabrina the Teenage Witch? Oh, wait. They probably don't know that either. Dude, they know Melissa Joan Hart. Everybody knows the teenage heartthrob, Melissa Joan Hart. <laughs> yeah, these days, I'm sure they do. Um, it's the same person, but uh, she explained everything. Like, everything I know about life, I learned from Clarissa when I was young. Oh, 
That was a Nickelodeon show, wasn't it? Yeah, that was Nickelodeon around the same time, like, Doug and Rugrats were on. It was one of their live-action shows. Someone did a good video about it recently. I think it was, like, Pushing Up Roses or some defunct or whatever the fuck. One of them. You know there was an episode of Clarissa Explains It All where she programmed a computer to write poetry? We still oh, don't yeah. really have that. Like, not even AI Dungeon can, like, actually do real poetry. It's pretty close. She made a game in, like, every episode. episode. She explained the meaning of life, but they took it off the air. It was too deep. She went to go see Pearl Jam in one episode, I remember that. I remember that, yeah, there was the whole, like, caper of the Pearl Jam tickets. <laughs> their friend named Pearl. Oh, oh man, this is like memories. 90s were fucking crazy, man. Crazy. Yeah, yeah chat, you don't know. Like, you now you have your YouTube <laughs> poopies and you have your TikToks, Tic Tacs. But back in the day, we had Clarissa. We had Yikes Bunnick. pencils. Remember those? Those were wild. Keenan and Kel. No. Yeah, Keenan and Kel were good. And the secret world of Alex Mack. I liked that show too because she was Odo from Deep Space Nine. Yeah, she's just <laughs> Odo. That's she, right. She was like, um, Capri Sun Odo. The kid ver yeah, exactly. <laughs> we're, we're not going to make that purple drop point, or I'm not, so I'm going to go. I didn't think anyone was. I'm going to go to the light so blue I'm gonna, one. I'm like, going to get rid of it. Or we'll go to this one. Yeah, this one's good. This town right here is good. Three of us are here already, so... Like, I was gonna go there, but then everyone started dropping out, so... <laughs> Never mind, I guess. I watched a video today about, um... Planes, Trains, and Automobiles, which is a really good Thanksgiving movie, by the way. And yeah. it's got Steve Martin, John Candy, and it had, like... There was an original three-and-a-half-hour cut of that movie, and they... Got, they had Jesus. to cut it down to 90 minutes. It's a comedy movie that was three and a half hours. And yeah, Steve Martin's really funny. He's is he? Yeah, he's still alive. Is he still alive? Yeah, okay. Yeah. John Candy's <laughs> not, but yeah. Oh. He's like uh, makes a lot of music, doesn't he? He's like. Yeah, he's just on Twitter making banjo music these days again. Like that's kind of what he does. But um, that movie's really good and. The video I watched was like a little mini documentary about how most of this footage is just lost. Like how there was more cut stuff from that movie than there was stuff in the movie. And it was apparently like really good. Like the script was actually really good. And they filmed it and they just didn't use it because the studio didn't think um, a, a comedy movie could be that long. So they got it down to 90 minutes. Uh, sorry. They got it down to two hours first. And then they're like, yeah, you need to lose another half hour. Kind of cool. But yeah, chat, if you haven't seen Planes, Trains, and Automobiles, that's probably one of the best comedies. Two really good performances, too. You know what movie's even better than that that's kind of based on it? <laughs> what? <laughs> so what are you going to say? <laughs> The, the rat race from the 90s. You remember that movie? Dude? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, wasn't Cuba Gooding, Gooding Jr. Mr. in that? It, it had John Cleese in it and, and uh, Mr. Bean. Yeah. Rowan Atkinson, yeah. And um, yeah. John Lovitz like was in Gooding it. Jr. John Lovitz it played Hitler. Like, it was yeah. like a fucking really bad version well, of that Well, that's not exactly true. But it's close. <laughs> he, he stole a fucking <laughs> Hitler's car from like a World War II museum. And then he injured his and tongue, just, yeah, and then there was shoe polish. Cigarette lighter. There was shoe polish just above his upper lip, so it looked like the mustache. And then when he spoke, <laughs> he was angry, and he couldn't speak particularly well because he burned his tongue. So it sounded like maybe a rally of some like, kind. It was really like it was ranting in German. <laughs> just one of those fucking moments where you're watching a movie and you're just like, "Is this happening? Is this real life?" But then he like they like. 
crash their car in front of that like a world war ii veterans like yep. meeting yep. <laughs> he just gets out and starts ranting and like tongues but it's, it sounds like he's just like doing a hitler speech yep I'm pretty sure smash mouth was pretty heavily featured in the soundtrack for the movie Wouldn't be surprised. oh yeah oh yeah they were in it they were in the movie yeah they they're at the end Oh, oh yeah, they are at the they, end. They, yeah. they, 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 um, when they finally get the <laughs> duffel bag full of money, Smash Mouth is the one who gets it. And then he's oh, like, there's yeah. like a billion dollars in here. And he starts yelling at that guy about bread, about throwing bread at him. Remember that? <laughs> <laughs> he's like, I'm not going to play this show if you guys keep throwing bread at me. And he like gets mad at them. Yeah. <laughs> that movie's so fucking funny. I want to watch it again. Yeah, that's a good one. So long. I haven't seen that in about a decade, but you know, it's underrated. It's called Rat Race. But, um, yeah, for those of you in chat who are like, oh, this movie doesn't make any sense. You know, like, everything's implausible. Watch John Lovitz become Hitler, and you tell me things don't make sense today. <laughs> what does he do now? I haven't even Punch seen Andy Dick in the face is what he does. I love it! You, you've heard about that story? I mean, who doesn't want to punch not. Andy Dick in the face? That guy sucks. Alright, so, okay. There's a big rumor that Andy Dick got Phil Hartman's wife addicted to drugs again, like like oh. offered her coke at a party, and oh that's God. why she eventually went off the deep end and you know killed Phil Hart. It's a tragic story. We're we're trying to keep things yeah. light on this game where we shoot people in the fucking face. But listen, what happened was it was a really tough time. We lost Phil Hartman. Andy Dick allegedly got some of the blame for this. Whether or not he had anything to do with it, I don't know. John Lovitz saw him at a party. He was drunk. He was fucked up, Andy Dick. And John Lovitz just fucking punched him out. Well, a he part of it was him out. Hey, he was commenting armor, uh, about armor up here. his role in news radio because negative, negative. Armor's here. He, uh, Lovitz had taken over for Phil Hartman's like position basically on that show. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. I didn't watch yeah, that show. so Andy Dick like made some kind of comment about how shitty of a job John Lovitz was doing, or something like that. And, and then him. Lovitz punched him out. Okay. John Andy Dick told John Lovitz, "I'm going to give you the Phil Hartman curse." Ooh. He's really living up to his last name. Wow. Like wow. Okay. What? What a fucking. I don't want to say it, but like, what a dick. <laughs> Right? Yeah. I mean, <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't think yeah. that's reaching. That's ridiculous. Yep. Yep. So that's a thing. Ridiculous. Mm. I, I never really Andy Dick wasn't funny. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Can you repeat? <laughs> <laughs> Context clues, Desert. You got this. I don't got this. <laughs> Um, I I don't know. I never really thought he was funny. My favorite like movie comedians. I always loved C Chris Farley growing up, and uh, oh, Phil yeah. Hartman was always great. You know, and Steve Martin, of course. Like he was in so many good movies. Oh, Robin Williams was was the best. Really, I mean, it's almost no one that could compare to Robin Williams. God, yeah, he was like in everything for a while. Yeah. So right for you. And he was a good dramatic actor, too. I remember they got him to, like, sh um, show off Spore when it was, like, first being unveiled. And he made, like, a penis monster. <laughs> you can make a new penis monster. <laughs> <laughs> he was, like, laughing his ass off in front of all the audience. Yeah, just sculpting. I'm pretty sure Max is just thinking, like, what the fuck did we do? <laughs> I, you know what they did? They built viral hype. This is really good. Um, I remember that. I loved that video. I watched it a lot. <laughs> Did you ever see one hour photo? No, actually. No. Isn't that a, like a he plays a stalker or like a creepy dude? Yeah, kind of. That's a you have to see that movie. That movie's amazing. Who directed that? Jeff, that? Do you know? Oh, I have no idea. Oh. But it's not huh? OK. It wasn't like a Scorsese movie or something, though. No, it's like pretty uh, indie film for its time, too. I, like. It's weird that Robin Williams is even in it. I'd like to hear the story of how they got him to take that part. It's, it's a very bizarre movie. I've heard about it. He also, what what movie was Robin Williams like? I think that was the um, 
Scorsese movie he was in. He was like a psychopath in the movie, right? Like that was, I guess that's what they would say his role was. I don't know. Insomnia. Yeah. Someone in chat said Robin Williams is dead. We got an enemy <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he is. It was very sad. That's his true statement. And, it was yep. extremely sad. sad. Death to Smoochie was a good movie, too. That was also yeah. Ed Norton. I haven't seen it's that. Yeah, I need to watch that. Oh, one. it's so good. Watch yeah, it, dude. Yeah, I've heard. Yeah, I need to. I'm glad I didn't make a statement earlier that would have been a spoiler for that film. Oh, oh. Because a very, very good... Yeah, you Insom know what I'm talking about. Yeah, I do. And Insomnia was Nolan. And who, who did Scorsese direct Williams at any point, or, or no? Oh. Not sure. No, I guess he didn't. I was thinking, what movie was I thinking that Scorsese did? Shutter Island, which is a very, very different movie, and he's that's uh, DiCaprio. Yeah, I love that movie for some reason. That's a great movie. I, I don't think it's one of Scorsese's best for me. Uh, yeah, but it's it's good. It's really good. <laughs> I just like I like the opening and the setup and stuff and the, like going to the island. It's creepy. And the music. I don't know. Yeah, it's very good. Like atmosphere. I don't love the ending and stuff, but yeah, but it's still worth watching. I like it. Mark Ruffalo is pretty awesome in it too. Yep. Vinny, did you see the new Matt McMuscles video about the Wii U? I did, and and Scott Lee the Wazley was in it too. Yeah. Bozzy? Hey guys. Yep, that's right, Kermit. Can you do it, Dave? Can you um, be your alter ego for a second what's, again? What's the line? Hey, hey guys, what? It's not hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> you have one job. No, well, what, I was asking because I don't watch him. I don't know. <laughs> it's uh. Hey there, Scott here. <laughs> Still wrong. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Yeah, it's even better that way. <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I like it better that way now. That's that's yours, Dave. That's your specific version. No one can take that away <laughs> nice. from you. Hey, fellas, Dave here. There you go. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Someone said, how do you feel about Jim Carrey? Um, hit or miss, but I grew up watching his movies. And uh, Truman Show is one of my favorite movies. I think he did a great job in that movie in particular. So. Now he, now he's going to be, what, Biden for the next four years on SNL? Yep, he's got a permanent residence. Yeah, that, that was like one of the worst impressions ever. It's seen. not good. It's really, it's I don't awful. know what the fuck they're doing with that. Fuck it's just, that. I, I saw like the clip <laughs> for a bit of it and I'm just like, ugh. <laughs> At least he was good in in the Sonic movie, though. Like I thought he was he was pretty good in that. <laughs> the most applause he got as Biden is when he just reverted back to Asimtra. Wow! What the fuck? Oh shit! What? What the fuck? What happened? There's a sniper. Did Jim you Carrey. fall down? He's moving in. Where where was the sniper? I don't know. Here. Well, what side of the of your skull I've got has plenty a of armor. Right? I'm good. It must um, have been out. Because okay. he's only. Oh, he was on the wall. I don't know. Over here, I'm, I'm tagging. I just saw a dude. He's running along the sewer sewage gap thing. The sewage. The Delaware water gap. Oh, I saw ah! the sniper. I saw him. Yep. Yep. We got. There, there's a, a thing. Oh. They're across the way. We're gonna have to start running. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. Yeah, we gotta get out of here. We gotta go. Man, Time to run. Time to run. Time to run. Here's <laughs> it. Oh, they're fucking everywhere. <laughs> I got myself. Hold on. They're on top of that roof over here. My fucking Jesus. did my shield save me? This guy's got to be in the gas. God fucking damn! Uh oh, I'm I'm watching my comrades die and I'm not doing anything about it. Oh. Chat, it's like Simon Private Ryan. Why couldn't I see him at all up there? Where is he? Oh, there he is. 
Nice. We're just scooting around. Just scooting with my bros. We need you, my friend. Oh wait, you didn't die. I got you. No, I didn't die. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. How the fuck did you live? Did they just not see you? I don't know. Now I'm dead. <laughs> God damn it. No, it's not that they didn't see me. Desert, I had a, a tactical shield on my back, and they hit that like uh, seven 7,000 times. Well, I'm back. I'm back now. Yeah, the right shield will defend your, your uh, back. You're up next, mate. Get ready. Dave, to your left. It's on the left side. Thank you. Yep. Win here and you return to the front no line. idea where we should go right now. Jeff, if, let me know where he goes. Right. He's going right down the middle. He's in the middle right now, waiting. Oh, yeah? He's peeking right directly in the middle. Yep. Now he's going to the left. Go to your right. Eat it. Okay, um, you guys are outside the zone, right? Uh, yeah, yeah we're just okay. outside of it. That's fine. I'm just. Oh, come on. I'm just outside of it, too. We just. There we go. Got him. We just gotta scavenge a little bit. We're close enough. We're for four on the gulag. That's pretty good. People in here, maybe. Vinny, I turned 30 years old now. Is your 30s better than your 20s? It's no. what It's what you make of it, mate. Hang on. Never mind that. No, this is the beginning of the end. It's all over. It's all downhill from here. My 30s were better than my 20s. I've been more successful, productive, um, and I'm I'm generally happier, I would say, in, in many ways. My 30s have been 2020. Oh, dear lord. What a fucking rotten time to turn 30. <laughs> You'll remember this forever. Until you don't. We're hoping for that. Mm. Uh, yeah, we should run. Especially you, Vin. <laughs> I'm running. But yeah, I guess it's, it's really what you make of it. And truthfully, I've... Um, there's ups and downs to getting older, of course, but, um, I, I guess, uh, on some level, you know more who you are, and, like, your tolerance for bullshit goes down a bit, I guess, and you also tend Sometimes. to, depending on the person and the circumstances, and, um, certain things that you let get to you when you're in your early 20s get to you less. Experience is nice. It's nice to have a, a pool of experiences and trauma with, from which to draw from. That's always good. Maybe not the trauma part, but... That's just called being a human. So, good luck! Sometimes I wake up and I'm just thinking to myself, Damn, still here. You did it. Like you Another day done. Um, you can take whoever needs this. Assault rifle. Assault rifle, And that in and of itself is an accomplishment. And, you know, it's good to say that. Of course it is. Yeah, it's good to be... count the things that are positive in the, the face of overwhelming negativity. Negativity! Oh my good god. That was just instantly dead. Whoa! And oh, from the roof! Up. That's where they are. Oh, they're on top of the building. Snack. Bunger. Oh wow, this dude was a machine. I didn't even get a chance to use my golden revolver. Play again? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good for another half hour. Really?
bungled that one. <laughs> it was bungered. <laughs> Someone in chat said, technically you only missed four or five times with it. My revolver. Well, think of it this way. I probably only needed two of those hits. Yep, where is V-Dub? Uh, as explained earlier, V-Dub is in New Jersey right now. Awaiting his medication. I don't know what that means. Penis oh, enlargement pills. Um, down, he, I think he's down with the sickness. <laughs> yep. Vinny, aren't you from New Jersey too? You know what? Yes. Staten Island is is New Jersey. It's close enough. Get yourself a proper warm up. We'll be deployed soon. Do you know Snooky? <laughs> um, what about the uh, the situation? Do you know him? I, I yeah, I have I have a sit rep. <laughs> I wonder. Yeah, is the situation's manager called the sit rep? Rep representative. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad you laughed. That's, that's nice. Don't let it get to your head, I laugh at everything. So... No, I don't know the Snooky, but I know uh, Snookies. I know several Snookies. We we have a lot of Snookies here. It's like how Red Letter Media has an entire cabinet full of the movie Nuki. Staten Island is that cabinet, but for <laughs> Snooky. <laughs> I just remember that South Park episode where they, like, made her into, like, a weird goblin creature. Snooky wants smush mush smush mush. Yeah. <laughs> About right, too. So, I don't know her person. I know, uh, the only famous Staten Islander I actually do know is Sal from Impractical Jokers. And I know him barely. Just, just a tiny, tiny bit. That's it. Well, I don't know neat. Pete Davidson. I don't know Snooky. I don't know Situation. I know Snooky personally. She's a really nice person. That's good. I'm glad. <laughs> it's nice to know that, you know, <laughs> the people that we see on the TV screen are nice in real lives. <laughs> Avoid the gas. Get to the safe zone. Why is the ghillie suit made of weed? Did you know that hemp is very resistant and it makes for a good, like, uh, material. Yeah, the first American flag was made of him. So what Jeff is trying to say is, this is very patriotic to wear the weed outfit. Yo, fuck the paper industry. Um, let's, let's go there-ish. You know what, I'm gonna tag over here instead. Let's go Pep there. Pep is better. I wonder who smoked the first American flag. Willie Nelson? Yeah, I'd believe it was it. the Twice paper industry alive. that was like originally why they outlawed it, right? I thought I read yeah. that. Hearst, William Hearst, newspaper magnate. Whoa! New York is trying to make it legal now because Jersey did. Good. Yeah. Retroactively, also, you know, like, make it like, so yeah. that people who had little uh, dents on the record maybe don't have them anymore because that would be great. No, I, I mean, if someone just smoked a doobie, or a, like, and had a doober yeah. in their car, like, like... Yeah, exactly. Why is that, that a problem? That should not... Yeah, that... <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. People should be able to have weed ghillie suits. Shouldn't be a big Ex deal. Exactly. For every, Honestly, every, every American. American should. <laughs> Jesus. The right to bear weed. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I just, I, like I said, for me, it's a, almost a non-issue. Because it's already decriminalized here, and I don't really enjoy it the way I used to when I was younger. It's, I'm too, it's, I'm too much of a mess to, uh, nah, enjoy it recreationally. That's, that's normal, I think. Yeah, I wish I could. I mean, a little bit here and there, it's like a rarity, I've said many times, but... I still think it's cool that it's it's gonna be, you know, 
more uh, available and legal for people because I've seen it help people yeah. that were sick and I've seen it help like people's pets and like people yep. that have certain you know um stuff and then well, they a lot of veterinarians take it and they feel good again. do like the CBD thing a lot yeah, of they do, do that now. and it works the CBD is yeah, good for for pets with like joint issues the there's an there's a weed joke in the word joint but I'm, <laughs> I'm not going to do it so yeah I was thinking about it but Germa. Is it is auto fed CBD? Is that true? Chat? Are you asking chat? There's multiple uses for they it. Know they, know they, they know Germa. They know Germa. They would just say yes, anyways. I'm off this way. Vinny, they would say he feeds it like black tar heroin. They, they would oh, say yeah, anything. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. But oh, Germa's the one that does the CBD. I do too. It's been a while, but I was doing the CBD melatonin stuff. And if I'm like in a particularly, you know, I have some oil if needed. You know, two fat cocks, oil. <laughs> that reference is gonna go over people's heads. God, that Never is mind. so old. But yeah, no, it's it's useful. I think it's a potential. I, I think some people think it's a miracle cure, and they're like, I don't know, feel nothing. Right, and it's like, yeah, well, it doesn't really, really like. It doesn't put you, like, into, like, Xanax mode. It's just, like, a little, like, it takes the edge off and helps if you have fucked up, like, fingers and arthritis. It's a calming agent. Yeah, it can help you sleep. <clears throat> With antioxidant properties, I believe. So, it's a nice thing. If it's... If it's used properly. Help me sleep a bunch. Oh, it definitely helps me sleep. I think people like to take it and then, like, expect to be, like, fucked up or something, like they ate, like, a giant-ass load of edibles. Right, that's a different- that's the THC. And, yeah, that's totally something different, but I- I noticed a lot of people are like, I don't feel anything, it's like, well, you're not supposed to, really. <laughs> yeah, it's- it- and some people may not notice it at all, really. There's some people I think are more sensitive to it than others. So, that's- What's that from? These edibles ain't shit. It's, oh, I'm being shot. Just, just a meme that often is... It's when you say these edibles ain't shit and then you get floored. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Oh, there's someone up here! Right here. Right here. What the fuck? Guys, there's a dude right next to, to us. All of us. There was right next oh to us. Oh my god. Got him. That was so close quarters. I had no idea what was happening before it was over. I couldn't tell who was who. Yeah, it was tough. Did you guys all die? There's only. I was shooting at everybody. <laughs> Fucking slaughter here. I don't know if there was a team wipe. Um, close enough. Does, uh, where, where am I aiming? Let me know where this dude is. Oh. Uh, you guys can get back there, there's like got so it. many dudes. Oh. Yeah, I couldn't even find him. Where was he? He was just hiding in the corner. In the spotlight? Losing his religion. To the AO. I'm back. All of our They're guns are still there. here. Holy fuck. I thought I heard someone walking up there. That's why I was waiting. Oh, is that you? Yeah, it's me. I'm looting all this stuff. <laughs> no, that's the an enemy. Oh, oh, the there's an enemy here, too. Oh. Got him. Got him. A lot of more, a lot of more guns here. <laughs> That's a lot of more guns. My You're not God. wrong. God, a lot of more guns here. Also, someone was shooting me. Me as I ran in. Jesus Christ! What the fuck are all these people? Doing? What the? Well, there's like eight more of them. Ah. I'm always a second too late. <laughs> oh yeah, then they're outside oh, too. Fuck what the fuck? I almost got all. Of them. What the fuck? Hot zone. God damn. These edibles ain't shit. Yeah, that's the, our reaction time is very <laughs> indicative of that. 
Holy fuck. Jeff's the only one who's got a gulag left. It's all up to you, man. Uh oh. There you go. Good, good gulag. From the hip. Copy that. <laughs> that'll that'll always get me. I'm gonna try to parachute into this helicopter. <laughs> <You're> gonna, <laughs> well, are you gonna like try and fall into its rotors and get chopped up? That would have that ended would very very well. Clogged up the rotors. That should actually do that. Try to die quick. I'll be trying. Then he That's awesome. I should change the title to Warzone. Because Call of Duty, Black Ops, Cold War, and Warzone are two different games on Twitch. That's true. It's too late now. I don't want to add another chapter to the VOD, so I'm just going to let it be this. The fuck are all the people in this game? Uh, directly ahead, apparently. There's a lot of red dots. The center of the circle. Oh, oh the there you Jeff, go. Get, I think you should get out of your vehicle. Oh, wait. <laughs> <laughs> well, that That's made for a good moment. Oh! Look at those Is that kills. That fucking javelin. Jesus, I, I like how a tire exploded into <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> yeah, we can do one more. All right. Just hang on a second. I have some. Cleaning to do real quick. Yep, cleaned up. All good. Gamer gunk. <laughs> no, I just, uh, I need a bottle of water. W water. I need sugar, water, sugar. Get yourself a proper warm up. We'll be deployed soon. I gotta turn the BRB. I haven't seen Men in Black in oh, so fucking long. Yeah, just doing this particular um, stream tonight has made me want to watch like three different movies. <laughs> Make a list. What's a good chat? What's another good Thanksgiving movie? Pretty much any movie, in my opinion. Is up for that. Lord of the Rings, honestly, but I'm sure you watched that to death. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. Thanks, Killing. Oh, yeah, that's good. God, I was about to say it. Planes, trains, and automobiles. We talked about that earlier. It's definitely a good one. Hostile dropping into the area. Watch the skies. I know what movie you should see. Right, that's enough fucking about. Which now one? Do this for real. From director Eli Roth. Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Wasn't that a Grindhouse fake commercial? Thanksgiving. I saw Grindhouse in the movie theater. Yeah. So I, it was cool, yeah. but I, I remember having to pee. So, my overriding memory of Grindhouse, both of the movies, especially Death Proof, which I enjoyed, but I just at the end of it, I was like, I need to pee. I want to see Death Proof again. We dropped there. See you in hell. 
Going to park? Loving that All right. Film. That's good. I, I really like that movie. I don't know why. Not a fan. I, I think it's it's definitely a grower, but it's also Kurt Russell. I like Planet Terror way more. Oh yeah, well, Planet Terror is like just the pacing is great. It's good, funny action. But um, the guy's got a jar of balls. The guy from Lost. That's that's right. What does he everything. have? The balls? Oh, he does have the balls. Bruce Willis is in there doing stuff. He's my favorite movie comedian. <laughs> When he shows up in a movie and he puts in like half effort, I'd laugh like crazy. Really? Break it down for him. How, how's that? Lay it off for me. Enemy now. Hand off. You guys kill that dude? Yep. Found the sniper right. Break it off for me. Oh, I got a red key card. What is this structure? This is a strange park structure. I don't know. Someone parachuted down over there. Looks like it belongs in a Halo map. It actually kind of does. Yep. Remember when Halo tried to be Call of Duty for a little while there? Yep. Like some some Call of Duty isms within the the, the Halo. Gameplay. Fans like that. I think like that was that. four. I think that was four. Yeah, that just came out on Steam. I mean, even Reach had a um, a sprint. Yeah, Reach had a little function, bit. but it, Reach was, I think, the pro proper balance. Oh, is this a bunger? A bung bunger. Uh, this is sick. This is where we would hide for the if this was like a big zombie apocalypse map. Like over Halloween, I guess. Armor box. What the fuck? Oh fuck! I got one of them. I should have used my RPG. Got him. Let me see it. Let me see it. Help him up. I got one. We knew there was someone down there, kind of. Well, we saw someone fall. Yeah. Or, or, yeah. And all the boxes were open, right? So. Someone in chat they said bunkers are hot zones. They dropped a lot of good stuff. <sighs> Close. Very good. Yeah, this is actually very legit things. There's so much armor down here. Just started blasting. There's an armor satchel over here if someone needs it. Munitions. I'm gonna drop right here. Need the ammo. I also have munitions. Oh, your gun is here, does. The reptilian. Eh? What kind of gun is that? LMG. Oh. Yeah. Uh... It's got good ADS. Yes, it's moving. See me, I'm gonna really use a shotgun. Why not? Shotgun here. Or, you know what? Yeah, instead of the shotgun, I'm gonna do the silenced here. SMG. It uses different ammo than my other gun, and it's, it's an SMG, so. What are we doing down here? Yeah, it looks like we're still in the zone. There's a lot of stuff down there, down here. There's like a fucking javelin. There's thermal uh, silenced SMG. That's good. Thermals are always good. Hmm. Ah, oh, fuck! I just missed the munitions. There's a heartbeat sensor here. The zone. Keep your Stun grenade open. now. I've never seen this scope in this game. Where you oh, can the go hybrid? Two times or one time? Yeah, they're nice. How do you ADS? How do you do it? Right click? Oh, okay. Vinny, the AR you have is really good. Plus stopping power rounds too, so... It's a nice day out.
Whoa, careful, don't get too close to the water. The weed watch? How do you use your watch? F, I think. No. I don't remember. Chat? Does anyone know? T. 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 And then you select look at watch. It's smoke. It, it, it. Oh my god, when <laughs> I look at my. It smokes! <laughs> my weed watch, like, puffs the herb. Jesus Christ. That's ridiculous. If you press T, you can graffiti. Yeah, I can make anime girls. What? Wait, what? Can you? Oh god, yeah. why why can you do that? See now I, They're my personal army. Now I have to find I probably have some anime unlocked. I need to use that. Oh, you can paint each other? What? Yeah, you can Excuse paint each me? other. Excuse me? I like how I hear gunshots, and I'm more concerned about us being able to spray paint each other. Huh. We've streamed Warzone like ten times, and just now we're figuring out that we can spray paint each other. By the way, and ruin the camouflage that we may have had. I like it. Cyberpunk 2077. <laughs> Vinny, you guys are gonna get high off the fumes. As if the watch didn't already get us fucked up. Gonna get tore up! Gonna get tilt. Are you sniffing paint again? No. This looks like the end result of a sewage system. Mm-hmm. More water knee-deep and poopy. This is just Russia. Duty oh. water. Vinny, you should try to spray paint oh, an wow, enemy. Oh, wow, we have a... Hold on, yeah. I have enough to get us a, uh... A, uh, loadout drop. I don't even need a loadout. I'm like, good to Yeah, yeah I nah. think I like my stuff. I just want the perks, man. Yeah, that's a good point, actually. There is an enemy in the distance, though. Stopping power rounds increase recoil, don't forget. Okay. You can spray paint gulag enemies before the round to make them stand out. What the fuck is this game mechanic? <laughs> oh, sniper, sniper, sniper. Oh, oh god, yeah, get inside. Come from, uh... It was come There's from a Saudis. lot of them. There's three of them. Yeah, I know. Vin, get inside. I'm getting inside. Running. I got hit in... What? Bad I got shots. shot through a wall. Oh. I just got shot through a wall. Yeah, that can They happen. have FMJ. That's a perk. What the fuck? How did he know I was there? They probably Accident. just guessed. Yeah, it seems what the like a fuck? Good guess. This perfect dark. Dave, are you stuck? <laughs> well, what is this Probably. Counter Strike? I'm not gonna risk it. Farscape. Whatever that gun was called. The Farsight. Yeah. Farsight. The Fargate? Ain't that that show with the? <laughs> oh, there's literally just a helicopter here now. Great. Fuck. I'm down. I just killed him. I'm down, I need help. Helicopter's about to blow up. Do you know where they are? Yeah, I tagged them. They're, they were coming from the direction they were shooting us in. Okay, yeah, well, I'm I killed them just one died of them. in that helicopter. They're getting, yeah. They're, oh, no, they're, they're still sniping out there. Do not go out there. One just came in through the bottom, I think. I had the door open. I just closed the door. But yeah, no, they they're just still, still sniping from the there, junkyard. Huh? Mm -hmm. There's a bunch of stuff on the ground right outside if you open the door, the way we came in. Oh, this door is open back here, too. I should've got, like, a proper sniper rifle. What Ooh! Them? Ooh! He just ran right up to me. 
Is the people gonna die? Up oh, outside. Got one. There's a bunch. There's a group coming in. Running, running, running. Uh, bah, bah, bah. Coming in. I doubt one of the dudes sniping us. Ah! What happened, Desert? Did you get sniped or what? I I got. He ran up underneath me and. Dave, you might want to be my up, ass up. Up, up here, perhaps. I got bullets. I got my line. radar. On. Okay. I'm gonna hide in here. I got butlets in my butt. They're on the other side of the left wall. All right, they're coming to the right. They'll fight for a chance to redeploy. Teammate redeploying to the AO. I want my log. North. Come back. Come back. Come back. Where the fuck are you? I'll keep an eye on over here. Remember that episode North of King Ryan. of the Hill where like Hank oh, plays fuck. paintball and gets shot in the ass? No. Your teammates. Okay. Careful. Yeah, they're right outside the front. There's one right there. Mm -hmm. I don't see any other movement. Dave, I'm gonna try to. Uh, yep, yep. Side, side, side. Which side? Right here. In the area. All right, moving up. That's the only two I saw. My god, it's so juicy. Jesus Christ. Well, it just gave away our position. I think they ran. They're not on radar anymore. <sighs> yeah, they made pants. Must have been silent. We almost have enough money to get Desert back. Um, there should be more money where our corpses were. I died what? like outside. Oh, scared the shit out of me. So you scared me. Probably out there still. Did you take them all down? There's some money right here. Too. I got it. We got it. Um, it's not a ton of money, but it's it's enough. Trophy system ready. Up! Oh, oh, someone oh. just sniped me. Get back in. Yep. Get back inside. Come in. Come in. Come in. Come in. Jesus Christ! From where? Did you see it? Move, move inside. Uh, I need to close the door. It was definitely like southwest. Move back. Sorry, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. Okay. Let me see it. Let me see it. I fucking like it's prioritizing Jeff over the fucking door. Yeah. Jeff, do you need armor? Uh, I'm all set, actually. Okay. I got a pack. It's context sensitive. Eh? Oh, fuck. The circle's about to move. Yeah, we gotta go. Oh, no, wait. We got a minute. All right. Do we? What do we want to do? We want to get Desert back, though. I think Desert. Can you tag where? Oh, there's a uh, store right, right here. Next to one. Here, let me drop some money. Where the fuck is it? Yeah, but it's gonna be covered. It's right around the corner. Right around the corner. Uh, right below that little ridge. It's below it. Yeah. I don't see it. Oh, here it is. A little further. Right, I got you. No, I don't. I need money. Fuck, I don't have enough money. Did, uh, coming, right, Jeff, you can get it. You can get it. I got enough, yeah. Oh my god. Alright, we got you. <laughs> we are we go back inside. three stooges. Uh, we're gonna have to move in 30. We should move now. We go, We should go... Uh, yeah, let's start moving. Yeah. Sniper. Moving up. Contact. Careful. No! Oh. Oh, I broke his armor, I broke his armor. <laughs> Jesus. He must have just gone after it. God damn it! Got one. Wow. Great game! Getting you up there. Thank you. Oh. I died down two of them. I don't know if they're Damn. down, down, though. If you can ping wow. one of them, I got an air spike. <sighs> yeah, I got them both, I think. Actually, I should air you spike a sniper. <laughs> Where the fuck? Where the fuck are you? <laughs> fuck. He was, like, back where we came from. <laughs> Time for a bit of RG bar.
Argy Bargy. Are you trying to fucking spray the dude? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, does anyone at Gulag right now can help? No. I, I, I can only see your screen. He's right in front of you. I got you it. Won. Good job. You would never have lived without me. That'll be $20. And an index. <laughs> no, don't you have one coming? Or no? <laughs> Not yet. Oh, okay. Like four weeks, maybe. Oh, okay. Great. Good spot to get shot at. Very nice. Enemy UAV overhead. Trophy system deployed. Okay, I'm in a little apartment thing, but... I can't tell if those were my own footsteps or someone else's. Probably your own. Oh, no, 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 that's definitely not you. Ooh. Sweat frog. Oh, great. Helicopter's here in two now. Excellent. Gas is inbound. Marking you I just heard a door open up. Yep. Oop, oh, yep. Right. <laughs> Literally right there. Bro, you in a bad space right now. Uh, I'm gonna put the claymore there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy sh- Oh yeah, that'll- that'll get him. That'll trick him. <laughs> you might want to push that back a little bit. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> I, no, no, no. No. You're drunk. Yep. Give me the god you're drunk. I'm gonna win this. With my shitty weapons. Oh, the circle's really getting small. Jesus. Well, you're gonna have people coming from behind you. Yes. That is very true. Probably bungered. Maybe. <sighs> Why do we need to claim more when I have a, a throwing knife? Throwing knife one hit kills. It does. I'm safe here. Yeah, I would say that's a good spot. I mean, other roofs a little bit farther away from you might be able to see you, but I think they're already in the, uh, the field anyways. Mm -hmm. That scare anyone else? The door opening like that? I was like yeah. too far away for it to. F <laughs> Boy, found an aid Holy shit! There's like 36 people left. This is gonna get whack. Uh oh. Here they come. Gas Ready? Moving in. New safe zone located. 
That's probably going to hurt you. Am I lagging? Uh. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Latency is fine for me. Jesus Christ. Oh, you got dudes on like those roofs <laughs> over there, I think. Nice. Ooh. Ah. That was a good last stand. Wag. <laughs> <laughs> so play again or leave? I, uh, I gotta do some bug snacks now. All right. Yeah. That's cool. Wag. Yeah, it was a good try. I enjoyed it. Still a lot of fun. Still a lot of fun. I like, I like this more than the Black Ops, like, regular multiplayer. But it's also... It just has a better game feel to it. I don't know what it is. Just, like, the movement just feels a lot less stiff. Yeah. To me. I agree. I actually agree with that. It's just a fun fucking game. Well put together. Yeah. And, uh, appreciate you lads joining me for this this was fun maybe we'll do it again sure. I, I might do uh who who amongst us has black ops cold war i do i got it dave you have it yeah oh okay we all have it um mm -hmm. zombies we could do zombies one day yeah i don't think yeah. sphinx has it and sphinx doesn't want it <laughs> and he has good reasons for not wanting it but yeah, that could be a, f a good future stream. Yeah, for sure. All right. Uh, so, chat, uh, thank you w once again for watching. This is Dave Cap, Desert P, and Vigibum. So, thanks, guys. Thank you. Thanks, All right. Ben. Catch you later. See you around. Ready? Yep. Bye. See you. No. Chat, Daniel, it is time for a quick break, and then the snacking will commence. Be with you very shortly. And here is a song to accompany your weight.
that's Chrono Cross. Well, I mean, it sucks that I can't play the music I like, as you've heard me say, every BRB for the past three weeks. But, um, you know, I like this music, too. Like, I can't play the rock music and the things that have the words, but I like playing Chrono Cross music. So, definitely worth, you know, jumping in during a BRB if you want to still hear some good music from video games. It's another Arnie Village. All right, and uh, yeah, Chrono Cross itself, if you want to watch, I have a playthrough of it, and it is still a game that I hold in high regard, but it's very flawed. A game that got tens when it came out, it was like universally hailed as an, like an achievement, and yet it's, you know, got some stuff that I would do differently. Another game that has amazing music um, that one day I would like to revisit is Final Fantasy VIII. I always say one day, I don't know when, I have to really be in the mood for it, because again, it's like a 40 hour game, but man do I love hearing the music in that game. And there's some genuinely really good cutscenes, so I just know that I'm going to be drawing from the same magic points over and over and over again. However, you get to see Squall say whatever 15 times 